World Champion Luchadora. Oh my god, that looks so good. Oh, I don't even know what meat is that. Is that pork? Is that... Uh, I have no idea, but it looks so good. Oh, okay, what the hell uh, am I looking at? Okay, for forget that, take a look at... Oh, that the, the meat looks really good. What's up, my friend? Today I'll be reacting to Brits try real tex Max for the first time. This should be a really interesting one. But before I go into that... Uh, can I ask you for one thing? If you can leave a like, thank you so much. It's the best way to show support. If you can subscribe, well, in that case, forget about it. You make my day. Have that in consideration. Now, link for the original video in my description. You guys end up recommending this one a lot. I love Jolie. Give them some love. That said, well, let's play it. Hey, we have come to Jolly El Dorado. Crack out the mariachi Ooh, bands. Texas. We are getting Tex Mex. El Dorado, man. Who El knew? Dorado. It was here in a car park. The is this a famous place? Yeah. Tex Mex food. Okay. Well, hello, everybody. Oh, hello. hello. I'm Joel. Hola. I'm Ollie. Hola, como estas? Y bienvenido. We went ahead and got you started off with some of the basics. Anytime you walk into a Tex Mex restaurant, okay. you're going to judge them on a couple of things guacamole, the queso, and the salsas. And oh. he's going to be arranging these from not hot to really hot. Looking good. Sorry, wow. I'm a bit overwhelmed. I feel like I'm in a Mexican wrestling ring and we yeah. just walked in and <laughs> we've just been punched in the face. I didn't see you nothing know yet. <laughs> Add a Thunder Rose you know what, my well, friends? I love Texas. I, I think it's such an amazing place. Uh, it's one of the places I would love to visit. And I know I have people watching me from Texas. I hope I'm really well received there uh, because it's a place that uh, fasc fascinates me. Well, on the way. We're trying to bring things back to the way we grew up, yeah. and this is how you start. This Amazing. Looks, this looks okay. incredible. That's it. Already, these like tortilla chips just look so much more handmade. Oh, yeah. Cheers. Yes. Wow. <laughs> Wait, what? There's guacamole. something else going on there. That's Holy moly. Guacamole. Is that the chips? Wait. <laughs> That. Yeah, that ships alone, that you don't even need to put anything on those. Th those are amazing already. Oh, that's crazy. I love America. <laughs> it's so good. Is it cheesy? Yeah. Mm. These, these cheesy. tortilla chips, I think they're the best tortilla chips we've ever had. Oh. Yeah. You've got the, the flavor of this freshly fried tortilla yeah, they, chip. They look like with Doritos. With nacho. That is incredible. <laughs> no, I genuinely, I don't, I don't need anything <laughs> else today. Is this okay, queso? So, yeah. Queso? Oh. Whoa. Yeah. Holy crap. I don't know oh. if I've ever tasted a cheese like that. Holy it's moly. like the milk of the gods. It is so, it's milky. I want to <laughs> drink that. Like, no, we're not so judging. Good. We can get some straws. We have wide mouth straws. Uh, okay, drinking that is a bit disgusting. Uh, I think you went a bit far there, but uh, oh, so far, so good. Seriously? It's specifically designed for case of slurping. No, is that? No, okay, okay. I won't believe anything you say. This is a problem. These are a couple more of our signature appetizers. This is our nachos con queso. We individually build every nacho so that each nacho you get is like more of a full symphony. So you never get a nacho that has no topping. Exactly. What the hell is that? Nacho is made for you. What the size of that? Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, try it. Oh my gosh. Is that like refried bean I think, paste? I think it's black beans or mushed oh, up. Oh, black see the beans. the size of that? that oh, is that just, looks good. I've never had anything like that and being able to call that Me nacho. neither. Look at this. Mm. Oh. <gasps> oh my gosh. See, that's right there. The guy, the, the that's the love. You, you the saw queso. the dripping queso <laughs> off the chip. You had the angle of the dangle perfected and you're only on your second nacho, man. I love Oof. it. Yeah, yeah that, guy's, that guy's American oh. already. She is a world champion luchadora. Oh my God, that looks so good. Oh, I don't even know what meat is that. Is that pork? Is that... Uh, I have no idea, but looks so good. Oh, okay. What the hell is uh, am I looking at? Okay, for forget that, take a look at, oh, that the, the meat looks really good. It has become a very... Tender Rosa, okay. 
A dear friend of ours. And this is just the classic crispy taco. Now, can I say, I'm really excited about this because oh, it's got to taste good. Because it doesn't look good. Oh. You know? It looks like it tastes good. It's incredible. like Ed Sheeran. You know he's talented, right? <laughs> he didn't get famous for his looks. He didn't get well, famous, he didn't famous for his looks. For he didn't. I mean, I love... I love. It looks really good. Am I crazy? No, that looks that looks really good. No chance that's better. I did not get this. I mean, maybe we have different standards, I guess. Amazingly, everyone loves that, right? But you know it's just raw talent. <laughs> you do. You do. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I, I can't argue with it. Mm. Oh, mate, that thing looks oh, I'm, I'm so angry. absolutely incredible. Just eat it. That's the best thing we've had so far. That's the best thing we've had so far. The meat inside is crispy, like a smashed patty. It almost tastes like a smashed burger in a taco. I would let that Mexican wrestler pummel me. She can suplex me in half. Because yeah. that she is can incredible. Me. <laughs> I'm not really sure good. that's a thing in Mexican wrestling. I love and you, you my friend. Move, tombstone. It's in a... But I have to bring my love to America, because I have to try that. Okay, why am I watching a, watching an Undertaker right now? That is so... <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's almost impossible for a neck to survive that move, you know? And I have a bad <laughs> neck. Tom Stone, right, <laughs> or something. Someone else needs to try this. Luke, can you please try that? Because that is genuinely unreal. Oh, all in one. All in one. None for Ducky. None for Ducky. That is... <laughs> Ducky's outraged right now. How good is that? It's naughty, isn't it's really it? Really good. It is naughty. naughty. It is. Josh, we're returning to the inferior delivery system, want, which is the brittle taco. I want to put some guac in this. Cheers, mate. Okay. Oh, the sound. Look, my friends, the thing with Texas... So, there is a huge influence in Texas uh, because of uh, uh, Mexicans, right? Uh, um... Wow, Texas is an amazing place, my friends, because... Uh, as the best barbecue in the world, I think it's fair to say. And there is also this stuff, uh, this is Tex-Mex Tex -Mex type of food. I, I don't know the, the definition that well. But basically tacos, tortillas. Um, oh, Texas is such an amazing place. <laughs> oh, the sound. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, wow. The texture difference, though. Texas, the my friend. Crispiness, from the crispiness. The crispiness the is so good. In the middle. This is, like, super soft, but the taco on the outside is warm. I think the last time I had a crispy taco was when we had Taco it's Bell. so good. And Shane. Taco Bell, yeah. no and chance. This is literally incomparable. No. Don't compare that with Taco Bell. To be honest, I tried Taco Bell a couple of months ago, and I kind of like it. So imagine... Imagine, if I like Taco Bell, I would love that. Taco Bell was decent, to be honest. I'm <laughs> joking, but actually, I, I like it. It's one of the few different uh, um, chain fast food restaurants we have here. You know, Burger King and McDonald's, very popular. Other than that, it's kind of rare to see the different stuff. Uh, we have pizza stuff, of course, also. Since you're in Texas, we wanted to produce a bowl of chili. Is that just any regular chili? No, it is an award-winning chili. Oh. Wait, what? <laughs> what is this belt? We won a chili cook-off last weekend. Oh, this weekend. is the big deal. Hey, this, this is, is a big deal. This is bowl enchilada. This is our Chef Renee's enchiladas. They're just I, good. I, I never There's no that. historical okay. significance. They're just good. Fantastic. <laughs> but his first dish as our chef was to create a mole. And that is a very classic interior Mexican sauce. So there are over 32 ingredients go into making the mole. It's hands down the Incredible. best mole in Austin, Texas. Wow. Chili. Okay, now we are entering new territory for me. I don't know most of those stuff. I know chili, but my chili does not look like that one. Okay, I'm discovering a new world. Let's go. I meant to ask, how do we eat that? Like, why, is it, why have we got saltine crackers? I guess we eat it on the saltine crackers. Oh, yeah. Like, uh, dip them in. Scoop it. Wow. Crackers? Okay. Oh, oh that's got all over me. Mm. <laughs> mm. Wow. That is rich. Whoa. That is very, very rich. That is such Believe an it. intense flavor. I totally understand why they won an award for this chili. It's very intense. Oh, that looks so yeah, good. Intense, but and so caloric at the same time, but so good. Oh, my. Oh, you know what, my friends? I'm trying to lose weight. 
you know, and this is this has been a problem because instead of losing weight, I'm, I'm gaining weight. Um, and reacting to this stuff, well, the good thing is I, I don't have a place to go to eat that stuff. But, uh, oh, it's difficult. I flipping love it. It's maybe not quite for your British palate. I mean, I'm struggling with this one. Look at that, oh. Luke. This is you. Do you have chili in England? Luke, you make chili, I bet you. Brace yourself. That is a lot better than any chili you've ever made. I'm it's guessing. a chili yeah. concentrate. You know, like with Ribena. Like double strength. Yeah, yeah it's, it is literally you like could, double strength chili. You could put chili. that in the bottom of an English I'm not pausing the video anymore. Water, I'm and triggered. It, was, it would dilute it. <laughs> because I'm angry. Jar, take it no. <laughs> It'll last yeah, not exactly. pausing the video anymore. Now we're moving on right. to enchiladas. Should we start with the mole? Look at that. What the so hell mole is, that? is like this chocolatey kind of sauce, right? Smell that. Oh, here's my... What is that? <laughs> it's good, but... Mole, 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 mole. Holy moly, yeah. <laughs> that. That is good. Holy moly. Holy moly, 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 moly. <laughs> he stole my joke. <laughs> I think that's my favorite thing we've had today. It's like if you made a soup that's out of Nesquik, thing. you know? Oh, that's and chocolate, cheese. okay. It's so... Chocolate. It tastes like it chocolate. It is chocolatey, but it's not... A Nesquik is... Okay, I like it. I paused it again. But is that good, my friends? I mean, I'm not, uh, you know, I would love to try it, but uh, it sounds weird to mix chocolate with, uh, with cheese, you know? But I, I trust my American friends, so maybe it's really good. Okay. But it's a... It's a it, oh, do you guys like that? Tell me in the comments. Because the, the mix sound, sounds weird, you have to admit. Uh, of course, if, if you try it, you might not think that, but looking... From you know, put in my position. Sounds weird, right? Chocolate and and uh, and cheese, but could be good. Massively underselling it. Yeah, I mean it's better than Nesquik. We have nothing like this. Chocolatey. I have no idea what these flavors are. So much flavor. Enchilada sauce filled <laughs> chicken. Is it in there? You've never had anything like that, have you? We don't have a reference point for that. I didn't think I could taste any more flavours in life. I feel I like I'm just trying new flavours for <laughs> the first time. That's so true. Honestly, though, honestly, that, that would be me when I go to Texas. And a little bit of Nesquik in there. I reckon you're 80% of the way there. Honestly, do you disagree with me? Yes. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 
They said it was spicy. This one just looks like cheese sauce. Wow. Yeah, it looks like cheese sauce, Either actually. they're messing with us or it's a wolf in sheep's, sheep's clothing. Yeah. It's probably the latter. Here goes nothing. It smells spicy. It tastes red. Holy crap, it tastes red. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's crazy. In my throat. Here you go, we got some oh, that's sweet crazy. and sour just happened. Okay. We the way with some milk. Well, okay, excellent. Milk. Wow, I'm sweating. We saw that happen, we brought the donut. What the? Oh, what the? At least that sauce. Or salsa or whatever. Um, okay, donuts. Oh, I love donuts. American donuts? I love them even more, probably. Because that will oh, wow. cool you down right away. And here comes some milk. Wow. Okay. <laughs> that is, that's actually a glass of milk. Um, almond milk. Oh, <laughs> milk. What, what donuts are these? Buttermilk donuts tossed in cinnamon and sugar. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's so cinnamony. Oh. Cinnamony. Yeah. Cinnamony. This is the perfect ending. It's so fluffy and light on the inside, but crispy on the outside and covered in this beautiful cinnamon sugar. You know, sometimes you have a meal and you're like, what am I going to do if I can't have this again? Like, I... We 100% cannot have this again. It's no going to be incomplete now, unless I have this again. I want to ask if they have Nesquik in the uh, Molo. No, no. Everything. Unbelievable. Can I'm I ask, can I ask so, a question? So cool. yeah. No, the, it's the, a terrible the question. Mole. Is there, oh. is there any Nesquik in it? Abuelita. So Abuelita is like the Mexican hot chocolate. It comes in the... Oh, uh, uh, wait. Oh, really? It's like these discs that you chop up and you melt into milk. Okay. So I'll be right back. like this totally. quick. Totally. I mean, it's a Nesquik. It's made by it's, it's, Nestle. It's Nestle. It is oh, yes. literally Nesquik, guys. Oh, is this popular in America? Abuelita. <laughs> That's a cute package. <laughs> It is. What? It's made by Nestle. I cannot tell you how long. Oh, wow. Thanks, Joel. I'm going to frame this just to remind Josh that I was right about the ingredient in the, in the mole. You nailed it, man. Yeah. Oh, this was amazing, my friends. Would you guys agree this was amazing? Oh, I don't know. I, I really like to react to, to Jolie. Actually, if you guys are not aware, Jolie was one of the... Um, the first reactions I did that actually did really well on YouTube. So I, I always enjoyed to, to react to, to them. Um, thoughts? It looks amazing. I mean, Texas, everything looks amazing there. You know what I mean? Not, I mean, not everything, but most things, <laughs> probably. Um, yeah. Thank you so much for watching, my friend. If you can leave a like, it means the world to me. If you can subscribe, forget about it. And yeah, thank you so much. See you guys next time.